Spectre and Meltdown. These two vulnerabilities have already stirred major organizations in the world right in the first week of 2018. Targeting the CPU architecture of Intel, AMD and ARM, that is your mobile processors, this is not any other vulnerability that will only affect certain systems. It rather affects mostly all the computers and mobile devices and has existed since many years. In this video, I am going to show you how you can check whether your Windows system is vulnerable and how you can fix it. What is up guys, Kai here back with another video. Before I proceed, please make sure to hit that subscribe button and be among the first to watch my reviews and latest tech news updates. First, let's try to understand what is Spectre and Meltdown. Our CPUs work in an interesting way by speculating the calculations in advance to speed up its performance. It does so by carrying out the processing you might need in future based on your usage. Now we being humans, our usage patterns change. And thus, it turns out that sometimes the CPU will have unnecessary data that is pre-computed. That data is thrown in a different memory section and it might contain some sensitive information which should not be accessible, right? Security researchers from Google's Project Zero last year exploited this very behavior of CPUs. They found that this memory where all these dump was stored is not securely locked down. And thus, attackers can read any sensitive information like your password, encryption keys, etc. In fact, it was also observed that an attack running on one virtual machine was able to access the physical memory of the host machine and through that gain read access to the memory of a different virtual machine on the same host. I'll link these technical posts in the description if you would like to read more on it. You can also click on the top right corner if you would like to learn more on virtualization. Now let's come to the most important question. How can you protect your devices against these vulnerabilities? Well, you are expected to keep an eye on firmware updates from your CPU manufacturer, be it Intel or AMD and update it. Along with that, several OS vendors like Microsoft and Apple are pushing out security updates for the same. So don't schedule them for later and instead update it as soon as possible. To check if your Windows system is vulnerable to Spectre and Meltdown, Microsoft has released a PowerShell module to do so. Let's open the PowerShell by searching for it in the Start menu and run it as an administrator. Now you need to type these two commands one after the other, that is install-module space speculation control and get-speculation control settings. If you see any error popping out, then you need to adjust your PowerShell's execution policy by typing set hyphen execution policy space bypass hit enter and press a hit enter again and then execute the commands again if you see most of the fields here are false in red that means your cpu and operating system are vulnerable microsoft has already released a patch for this and in case you don't see this particular update your antivirus might be the culprit since it is expected to make some registry changes first. Microsoft has already instructed antivirus companies to comply and keep your antivirus updated too. Once your windows is updated, you can verify if you are still vulnerable by executing get hyphen speculation control settings command in PowerShell again. And it says your windows OS is secure here. Now all you need is a firmware update from your CPU manufacturer, be it Intel or AMD. Once everything is patched, all the fields here will be in green and you will finally be secure. Once you are done, don't forget to reset your PowerShell's execution policy by typing set hyphen execution policy space restricted. Please note, Intel has said that it will push out the updates for all its CPU models that were manufactured in last 5 years. So if your CPU is older, you might want to consider updating it. For your mobile devices running on Android, Google has already pushed an update. So make sure you have the December security patch level installed. 
Even Apple pushed out an update fixing these vulnerabilities for their Mac OS recently. Google has said that Spectre is harder to exploit and even harder to fix. So it might take some time for your device vendor to push out the security update if you haven't received it yet. Thanks for watching. Please hit the thumbs up if you liked the video. If you have any questions, comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will talk to you soon. Peace.